Hey again. Hello. Well, we had great plans for today. Yeah, we did, but, you know, things uh, changed. It was closed, so, yeah. yeah so, we're going to kind of go to where it's kind of open, but yeah. it's kind of delicious. Yeah, yeah. We yeah. can't we can't do everything this there because it's a Sunday, but there's still some good stuff to do. Yeah. So, we're going to go take a ride up the road, Henderson's own Ethel M's Chocolate Factory. Yes, so, and Cactus Garden. Too. Yeah, which is, like, really cool. So, it's not Willy Wonka. No. No Oompa Loompas. No. But, but cactuses good, and chocolate. And good chocolate. Yes. Yeah. So we'll see you there. We made it. We are here at Ethel M's. Yep, there we go. It is the Henderson version of Willy Wonka. That's right. When I look at it. So we're going to scope out the cactus garden first. There's kind of a map, and it's, a, it's just cactus. Pretty cool. They decorate this at Christmas, too. So, yeah, we, we'll have to come back in December. Yes, definitely, because it, it's quite the crowd in December time frame, but today it's, is pretty quiet around here because it's like 100 degrees. So yeah. it's a hot day. <laughs> so needless to say, we're close to the airport where we are here. What's nice and kind of fun is they have some road signs for where we're going. Prickly Pear Parkway and the tasting room, which we're going to hit in a little bit after we walk through the garden. So, so here at Ethel M's, it's not only a it's not only a chocolate factory; it's apparently a solar factory as well. It's, it's a green chocolate factory. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know as about that. And yeah, we're on the flight path for Las yeah. Vegas as you uh, could tell. airport. Yeah. yeah, but yeah, that's, a lot of the stuff they do is they use the solar power, so it's kind of nice that uh, in the desert with a lot of sun, they're yeah. smart enough to use solar. So kudos, Ethel M's. And here we have the infamous jumping choya cactus, which. Yeah. My son, Zach, it's his arch enemy because, boy, he get near it and he it jumps. Enjoy it. It, yeah, it jumps. Yeah. Actually, it has a sensor, and if some movement comes too close to it, it does shoot little balls uh, of, off of it with it has the spines on it, so it's, it's natural defense. Yeah. So I took a picture of a sign that said, don't touch the plants. This is why. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we were founded by Forrest Mars from the Mars Corporation. Uh, we started, he had retired from the Mars Corporation in 1976, moved to Las Vegas to retire, and he was 80 years old, filthy rich, and bored out of his mind. So he started making the chocolate liqueurs to put on the pillows for the high-end casinos. And from there, because of the looser liquor laws of Nevada, he was able to start producing it. So he started work on this place in 19... 79 opened up in 81 and uh, named it after his mother. All right, let me see what else here. The cactus garden? Oh, the three acre cactus garden. 
uh, desert landscape and what's his other passion, as you can see if you look out there. Mm -hmm. So we now have a three acre cactus garden with over 300 different species of cacti that we light up every year for Christmas with over a million and a half lights. Wow. We also do it now for, excuse me, for Valentine's as well. Only two weeks, but just as nice. Might have to come out here in February. Yeah. You should. Yeah, we do love Christmas. I haven't seen the... the uh, oh, Valentine's. you got it. They've got Santa Claus out there. They've got the children's choir. Oh, wow. They saw the big snow globe. A what? This big snow globe you compose in for pictures. Snow like, globe? You out. know, I haven't walked by that session. It's three acres and I haven't even walked the whole thing yet. Oh, wow. Actually, okay. I tried one time and I actually got lost. It was really <laughs> the bosses were looking for me. Oh, no. <laughs> well, I appreciate George. Thank you for the information. Oh, not a problem at all. If you need more, let me know. All right. Thank you. You got it. So we get the bullet. We did. Yep. We're going to do a chocolate taste next. Yeah, just, wait. just chocolate. Yeah, just chocolate. Oh, no just wine. chocolate or chocolate and wine. It's too yeah. early on a Sunday morning for the wine part, unless you're in Chicago. Oh, well, you know, there you go. But anyway, yeah, but definitely if you have a chance, do the wine tasting. And if you don't like wine or don't like to drink, then just do the chocolate tasting. Definitely well, worth it. My if you don't like chocolate, just drink the wine. The wine. Hey, I like that. <laughs> so we're getting ready to go in and have some really good chocolate. chocolate box over there? Oh yeah. So they're oh, doing cool. actually Doug uh, Valentine's boxes right now for yeah. boxes. And so when the uh, things come out of the whole uh, cooling tunnel, they're in these trays, they pull the chocolate out of the tray, they don't dump the chocolate out of the tray. So the tray stays in this line here. So they do two things, they break it from the bottom and they break it from the top. They just pull it from the bottom and the top, loosen the chocolate up, then the machine goes through, stamps down, picks up just the chocolate, then moves over and puts it on this conveyor belt here. It was fun. It was a lot of fun. We did not escape on skates. No, it, at the lounge you can spend probably as little or as much as you want, and it can get a little pricier than our normal excursions. Yeah, that's only by choice because yes. to go there is it's free. free. The cactus garden is free. Free. Chocolate tasting not so not free. so free, and then the temptation. At the end, there's a store. Yeah, and, yeah not free. Not free. Not free. But, really but delicious. Good. Yes. Yeah. So we had a good time. So we, I know what we're doing next week. You should know what we're doing next week. We're oh, gonna, we're going on a special trip. Yes, yeah. we're, we're gonna go to Arizona. So we're gonna have some fun in Arizona. Yep. And uh, maybe see some old Indian remains, mm -hmm. maybe a train, maybe a ghost town. Mm -hmm. Who knows, it's gonna yeah. be a lot of fun. Oh, so. Crazy Andy Renee will be there too oh, next yeah. week. Look so. out for that. All yeah. right guys, so until next week, we'll see you. <laughs>